Good morning. Welcome to our morning devotion. Glad you are tuned to the morning encounter. It is our prayer that you will encounter with God through this broadcast. And now, let's welcome the servant of God. Praise the Lord, dear viewer again. Uh, as we've been looking throughout this week, we've just uh, dwelt on one particular place uh, and the place has been the place of the ten virgins, five were wise and five were unwise. Today, we want to look at uh, a point which we find from the story uh, of the ten virgins. Uh, and what we want to look at today is that Whenever we lose an opportunity, then that opportunity does not continue, uh, does, not, uh, does not become ours. Now, when the st- in the story, the Bible talks of the, uh, of the five who are foolish. After the bridegroom had arrived, the five went out to look for uh, oil out in the market. And afterwards, they came back and they knocked at the door and asked the bridegroom to open for them to come into the banquet. In the story, the Bible says that the bridegroom told them, go away, I don't know you. And when I was reading this, I was really wondering, how come that the bridegroom would tell the the, the foolish virgins that he did not know them? I believe they had been invited for the banquet. I believe that the bridegroom had invited them together with the wise. And that is why they were ready and they were waiting for the bridegroom. But immediately the door was shut. Immediately the bridegroom arrived and they went into the banquet and the banquet began. Uh, That opportunity was closed. What I realized in the story is that uh, whenever we miss an opportunity, that opportunity is completely taken away from us. We lose ownership of the opportunities which had been presented to all of us. In the book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 9, the Bible says that the race is not to the swift or the battle is meant for the strong, but time and chance happens to them all. That is the wisdom of God. He has given all of us equal opportunities. He has given us equal, um, uh, you know, uh, opportunities to seize. And only those who are prepared for those opportunities can take up the opportunities and they seize the moment and they capitalize on the opportunities. And so, whenever we are not ready, whenever we do not make necessary preparation in life to achieve certain goals, to achieve the dreams we have, uh, such opportunities may come and go. And when these opportunities have gone, it's so sad what happened to these uh, foolish virgins. The bridegroom came to the door and told them, I don't know you. Whenever we miss the opportunities, then we lose ownership of the same opportunities. But whenever we seize uh, the opportunities that come on our way, then we can enjoy the benefits that come with those opportunities. I want to pray and encourage you today that you don't lack, you don't lack the wisdom, you don't lack uh, the wisdom, uh, and so uh, and so miss on the opportunities that lie glaring before our faces and before our eyes. May the eyes, may your eyes be open of the Lord, so that we may look at the opportunities that are before you today, that are before you in your places of work, that are before you in your, pl- you know, in your marriage, that are before you so that you may take the necessary or the benefit or seize the moment of those opportunities. Let me pray for us again this morning, even as we go out into the day. Our Father and Lord, I want to pray for all of us that today, Father God, we will seize uh, uh, the moment. We will seize on the opportunities that come on our way. Whenever we miss on these opportunities, then we lose ownership. I want to pray, Father God, that by your grace today, we are going to seize on every opportunity that you have set for us, for us to accomplish our purpose and our destiny in this life. 
May you bless us, O God, because I pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. That was the morning encounter. We are glad that you tuned in. Follow us on YouTube at Sidim Eldoret TV. Our Facebook page is Sidim Eldoret. Our Twitter and Instagram handles at Sidim Eldoret. And our website is eldoret.sidim.org. Let's encounter again tomorrow morning, same time, same place.